Hey everybody, welcome for a very special episode. We are at Matt's Guitar Shop for Matt's Guitar Shop TV or YouTube channel and today nobody can stop us. And it's not a joke, we are going to show you a collection that fits the guitars that John Fucianti of the Red Hot Chili Peppers played all along his beautiful career. Here is the first one that we just found in Germany. It was in a collection and we just found it in Germany maybe months ago. And this guitar has been seen by millions and millions on, of people on TV, in shows, and it's not there. <laughs> <laughs> hey everybody, welcome to Matt's Guitar Shop TV for another episode, and today's episode fits another can't stop thing, and nobody can stop that episode today. It's not only a joke. We are going to show you some guitars that John Fulcianti from the Red Hot Chili Peppers play all along, along his magnificent career. The very first one, and I hope it's in the case, the very first one has been seen by millions of people on TV, and this is when John returned to the Red Hot Chili Peppers after he quitted for the first time. And this one, we surnamed it um, the Can't Stop Strat. Um, that's a strat that was totally custom made by Fender, it's a one-off and um, the producer um, rented it for the video and John played that guitar for the video. The producer had to fight a little bit for John to play it on the video um, because it's totally modern, it's a modern style instrument, you know, the bridge, tuners, sparkling finish, that's not really something you would see John Fruccianti playing but um, you know, that's the guitar, it has been seen millions of times. It's iconic because everybody has been seen that famous video clip Can't Stop and that's, you know, the moment where the Red Hot really came back at it and uh, well, it came back in the right spot. So that's the very first guitar we're very proud to have here at Matt's Guitar Shop. It was a long safari and once again, big help from the guys from the John Fucianti forum. The second one, that's the title of the video, is finally John Fruciante a Gibson guy. Because this Gibson has been played by John Fruciante in his solo record on stage um, and most likely has been in his collection for 16 years. So finally, is John a Gibson guy? Original Gibson brown case. What's, what's in the case? Maybe something you haven't seen before. Because there you go. This guitar is an ES-335. That is a very special Gibson ES-335. It came from uh, a collection, one of the biggest guitar collection of all time called the China Recollection. And then it, it went to a friend of us who is a good friend with John uh, for a number of years. And this guitar has been, as it fits a very, very particular finish called Argentine Grey. Argentine Grey has been offered by Gibson for two or three years maximum and didn't have a really good success. So um, it was quite rare and totally on custom order. It's a 61 Gibson E335, one of the very first stamped serial number of the headstock. On the back of the headstock, double ring cluson tuners and original PAFs. And this is, to my knowledge, um, the only Gibson ES-335 ever, I've ever seen in person which fits that very unique Argentine grey finish. It's not grey, but that's the way they call it. <laughs> so that guitar is maybe the best whole body Gibson we have, we have played so far. It's in my collection, it's not for sale. Uh, but I wanted to show this one to you guys. Um, it's really a special guitar and you can see a, a video on YouTube. Um, in Los Angeles where John played that guitar on stage with George King Knopfler on the drums. So that's a very special one. And it was in John's collection for 16 years. Then it came back to another celebrity who sold it to us. And uh, it has been featured as well on the very famous premiere guitar uh, where they show John's collection. That, so that's the one. And to finish John's collection, 
of, uh, I'm going to show you a very special PC. Follow me. <coughs> and for the John Fulciante fan, this one, I think you already recognized it, right? This one is Z V Pro video, the Dutch iconic Dutch video, uh, where John just left the papers and um, <coughs> he had a fire in his place in Los Angeles and then he just had this guitar which I think was belonging to his girlfriend at the time and that's the one, that's the one you can see where John was having <coughs> some issues and but and at the same time was creating his very famous uh, solo album that the fans are liking so and I do like it, it's amazing so that's a K K230 I think and it's a transitional model because it fits like the bridge has been changed since John had it. Um, the guy that was holding the guitar in Missouri um, added a, a volume pot. We're going to restore that someday. Uh, but it fits the very special marks as I was um, saying in another video of the show. Um, and you can check it if you want, but that special marks. These very special marks here, here. It fits and um, it's completely identical to the, doc the documentary that you can see John playing it. So that's a very, very high story guitar if you love John Fucianti. And I think right now the other place in hers where you can find more John Fucianti home guitar is in John's house. So feel free to check it out, but it will be much more easier to check them here at Matt's Guitar Shop. So everybody is welcome. Uh, if you like this video, and the, fa the fact that we shared those pieces of history with you guys. Follow us, it's I think here, and uh, you can click on the button. Subscribe to the channel if you want to check other pieces we do have. Thank you, have a good day, and see you for another episode of Matt's Guitar Shop. Bye.